<laughs> What's event cinema for you? Um, well, I think we need to think about new ways of bringing people to the theatres because if we keep on doing it the way we do it now, it will maybe even vanish, the experience as we know it now. So I guess we need to think about ways of making it a real unique experience and also making it uh, a social event. But it would target a younger audience. Yes, of, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure about that. Yeah. I mean, because in Germany, at least in between 2016 and 17, we had a rise in the audiences of my age, contrary <laughs> to your age, it was like, I think, I don't know how much, but I mean, the majority of the people who go and watch movies and actually buy a ticket yep. are like 55 plus. And I'm not sure, and I'm 55 plus, so I'm not sure if I would really move my body to go to an event cinema because it would be just too much for me. So it yeah. would mean that you would target yeah. a younger audiences. One of the things you, you really can do is make it more of a social interaction. So even working more with um, uh, even restaurants and bars or curation uh, about mm -hmm. certain topics that are linked to what, what is screened uh, or even maybe VR, experience, uh, VR experiences that are linked to what is screened on, on, on the big screen. So I think, I mean, you have to trigger them and bring them back to the theaters. Mm. If not, what will happen? And basically, you're, you're trying to trigger the people away from Netflix and Amazon and whatever it yeah. is, which I can understand. I mean, if they're like 35, have two kids, um, it is really costly to go to the movies. Um, sure. That is a point. It's just um, a matter of, of, of opening the perspectives a little bit because, well, we, we, we see that it's not working the way it was working like 10 years ago. So we need to rethink some things. Mm. It's, it's, it's but I mean, how about, do you believe in interactive storytelling, like immersive storytelling, that the non-linear storytelling, do you think that's really an industry there? Yes, I think so. I think so. And not rather an art house version of transmedia or whatever you call that? No, I think we really need to, to open up the perspectives and many times it feels very theoretically and people are having long conversations about what we could do. But I'm convinced that we just have to try things and to broaden it up and, and, and try to f rethink the way we are thinking and creating now. Um, and um, that, that's my opinion. I mm. don't think that it's an issue thing. Not at all, because we'll need new ways of telling our stories for sure. I mean, we we have to keep on searching for that. And, mm -hmm. uh, and I think it's very interesting. I'm, I mean, it's not that scary. We just need to try. No, know. I don't think scary. It's just that in my experience, but then of course I'm like a different generation than you are. In my experience, it's I want the story to be told to me. I don't want to be part of the storytelling. I just want to... When I go to the movies, I want to start watching the film. I want to dive into the world that's being opened up to me. And I don't want to be interrupted and being forced to answer any questions or decide anything. I just want them to tell me the story until it's finished. And if it's a good film, I feel good afterwards. If mm -hmm. it's a bad film, then I'm unhappy. Yes. Um, but I don't want to interact in order to move the story forward. Because yes. But that's well, maybe a generational thing. I'm not sure if it's a generational thing, but I think it's a very personal thing. Not everyone likes the same ways of getting stories. I mean, it's just a matter of finding out who is the audience that really is triggered by telling stories in another way. And of course, yes, most of them will be maybe a younger generation, mm. but then the younger generation will become the older, older generation, well, yeah. so this is the time to really, I mean, experiment and, 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 and figure out what works and mm. which ways we can, we can go. I mean, I agree, because I think that, I don't think that every story is usable for that no. kind of experience. It depends on the kind of stories you have, but I think it can be an add-on.